Why Africa's Billionaires Are Fleeing Their Home Continent In this video, I will be sharing to you some of the major reasons why African billionaires are fleeing their home continent. Hey, it's James from Africa Reloaded. I will be expatiating to you why despite the fact that Africa is such a rich and diverse continent with a lot of business potentials and opportunities to offer, many African billionaires are still fleeing the continent. If you have ever wondered why there are few or no jobs in Africa and why many billionaires of African descent rather invest in America, Europe, and Asia. I have spent some time looking for answers to this question and in this video, I will be explaining to you why. I will appreciate a thumbs up from you as we ride on. Some of the richest people in the world reside in Africa, but during the past 20 years, there has been a sharp rise in the number of African billionaires who have left the continent. Only 23 of the 52 billionaires who were born in Africa are still present on the continent, according to the Africa Wealth Report 2023. The Regulatory Climate In fact, Africa has one of the least business-friendly legal and regulatory systems in the world. In comparison to other regions, registering firms and obtaining various licenses is more difficult for African business owners. Sub-Saharan Africa contains 20 of the lowest 25 nations, according to the Doing Business 2010 survey. The average ranking of African nations for ease of doing business overall is 137 out of 183 economies, according to the 2020 Doing Business report, as opposed to 72 for Eastern Europe and Central Asia, 96 for Latin America and the Caribbean, and 87 for East Asia and the Pacific. Because they are over 20 times more expensive than in OECD nations, business registration and startup costs in Sub-Saharan Africa contribute to the region's high rate of informal businesses. Lack of investment opportunities. Doing business in Africa, business ideas, policies, and laws are erratic in several African nations, which makes it challenging for businesses to prosper. Many African billionaires discover that conducting business in industrialized nations with solid legislative frameworks and more accessible investment opportunities is simpler. Also, it is difficult to expand enterprises in Africa due to the absence of suitable infrastructure particularly those for transportation, energy, and communication. Business security. Security issues are another reason why millionaires from Africa are emigrating. Political unrest, terrorism, and bloodshed are commonplace in many African nations, which poses a risk to people's lives and the security of their companies. Several billionaires find it challenging to stay in Africa due to the threat of kidnapping, ransom demands, and even death. Thus, many African billionaires see it as a risk to invest and do business in Africa. Taxation Laws Billionaires are also fleeing several African nations due to their taxation laws. High taxes can be a major burden for businesses, especially for those that are just starting out, even though taxes are important for a nation's growth and development. High tax rates are prevalent in many African nations, which can cause significant financial losses for firms. Another reason why African billionaires are leaving the continent is the high levels of illicit money flows from African nations, as well as the recognition of the potential of tax openness and information exchange to raise resources for development. Poor e-commerce potential. We have demonstrated that Africa has a huge potential for e-commerce growth. However, significant obstacles to the growth of e-commerce on the continent still exist. The biggest of these include cybercrime, a weak legislative system to enable e-commerce, and insufficient consumer protection. The fact that more than 50% of Africans lack internet access is a key factor for the low e-commerce potential, causing African billionaire to leave the continent. The exodus of millionaires from Africa is not entirely a bad thing either. Other business people and investors may have the chance to step up and take their place. Some billionaires' disappearance leaves a void in the market that other business people can fill. The regulatory environment, infrastructure, and tax structures can all be improved by African governments to increase their nation's investment appeal.
The choice of whether to remain in or leave Africa as a millionaire is complicated and nuanced. It requires taking into account a number of variables, including political, social, and economic stability, as well as individual safety and corporate efficiency. In the end, each person must make their own decision based on their particular priorities and circumstances. Thanks for watching to the end. Please take a few seconds to like, share, comment, and subscribe to Africa Reloaded.